go. Welcome to Creations by Karen for another $10 Tuesday. So I never let you know ahead of time when I'm going to make it because usually I'm just winging it, but today I planned. So here we go. Let's make a craft worth $10 or less. So I got this wreath form at Dollar, uh, Dollar Tree, actually, Dollar $25. Uh, I'm going to use a couple of rolls of ribbon, and I did get these last year at the end of the season, and I think they were $2 each. So there's $4, so we're looking at $5.25. And then I bought this really cute, well, it's called a basket accessory at Dollarama. It was $2, so like we're way under $10. Hey, Lise. How are you? Okay, so let's get going. So I'm going to use this, it's like jelly bean ribbon that I got. And they have it this year too, but I always buy stuff at the end of the season. So I don't have to pay the enormous price. Hey, Jerry. Glad the snow stopped. Oh, dear. Still, eh? Still drifting? Eey. You're going to need some hot glue, which is ready to go for me. So what I want to do is I just want to wrap this wreath form with this jelly bean ribbon that I have. So I'm just going to place a bead of hot glue. Doesn't matter where you start, I don't think. And I'm just going to place my ribbon on here. And I'm going to hold it for a sec. Okay. What's everybody doing? Oh, looked at our numbers tonight and saw the news. Ten, no, twelve COVID cases in London today. Forty in Thunder Bay. Craziness, man. Crazy. All right, so I'm gonna hold that in place with this finger. Still a bit warm, but you know I'll take the burn for you guys. And you're just gonna wrap this really securely so you want to make sure it's really tight going all the way around and I'm going about halfway through the ribbon maybe a little more than halfway maybe a three quarters of the way and I'm just going to wrap it around my wreath form so you don't always have to buy a wreath form or um, you know an expensive board to make something you know, everything is about using your imagination and making it work. You try to do use things that you have available in your home. If you're crafty, you always have piles of stuff. I know I do. Okay, so just keep coming around. And this will twist. And just ignore it. Keep coming around. Keep going. Maybe I'll try to unravel it here. Should be an easier way. Haven't found it yet though. So just keep going. Just ignore the uh, curling of the ribbon. If you're holding this really snug, you don't need to worry about it. Uh, this ribbon is three yards. So if you go to your local Michaels store right now, go to the ribbon section, they have a whole bunch of ribbon that's on clearance. I managed to scoop up some of that, um, which is like, would normally be like $12.99 a roll. And I got it for like three bucks. So I bought a lot of it. Not a lot of ribbon. So I have a lot of mesh, because I always buy mesh when it's on sale, because paying $17.99 for a roll of mesh is just craziness, I think. So keep coming around. If you're here, I see a lot of people here and you're not saying hi, you know, I might give this away. But I can't give it to you if you're going to not say hi. So just say hi. So if I do decide to give it away, you'd like to be a part of that.
Hi Heather Heather, it's nice to see you today. Keep coming around guys, that's all you have to do with this. Beginning. See I'm at the end now. Luckily I have another one. So that's five yards that it took just to go around this wreath form. That's okay. We'll just keep going. I got another roll here. Me, me, me. Okay. Huh. All right, Lise. Are you working Friday, Lise? Hi again, Carla. Lisa, are you working Friday? Hi, Trace. It's my sister. Okay, so I'm just going to fold this in place for a second while I get my other roll. It's a partial roll. Hopefully that'll do the rest of it. So I'm just going to place this. This will be the back, I guess. So. Maybe I'll clip this off. Hey, Nance. Yeah, first. Okay, what time, Lisa? What time are you working? So I'm going to be there at the crack of dawn. Hey, Pam. Okay, a little bit of beat, little bead of glue going on here. Just place this down. This is at the back, you guys are going to, you're not going to see it. Alright. So, just let's go around. Keep going. Hopefully I have enough with this roll. And around we go. Too early. Oh. <laughs> I will see you. Good. Okay. Awesome. Yep, I'll be there. Okay, so we're coming to the end. Luckily, this little bit. So I used five yards and a bit. These rolls are like, if you're buying a full price roll of this, it is $5.99 for five yards of, roll of ribbon, which I think is crazy. That's a crazy amount for a roll of ribbon. Okay, so I'm at the bottom here. And I'm just going to put some more glue. Oops. Oh. Hey, Fran. Okay. So just hold this up in place until it's secure. Oh, okay. Okay, good. All right. All right, so I've wrapped my whole styrofoam wreath form with this jelly bean ribbon. It's really cute. I've used it in a lot of crafts this year. I quite like it. There we are. So this is what was left. So I probably used seven yards. I know, Annie. Three days in a row. Crazy, right? Well, it wasn't supposed to be Sunday. Alright, so there's where we're at. Okay? Now I'm going to make a bow. And I'm going to use this really nice... Um, sparkly blue ribbon for it and I'm going to make a generously sized bow. I'm going to get my dope bow dabra which is right here. <clears throat> Got my bow dabra and now you're not going to see the middle of this. Now this is one-sided ribbon so you got to twist this. Hey Deborah, how's it going? So I'm gonna make three loops. And I haven't done this before. This, you know, I kind of I kind of complain. Hey, and that I gotta come up with stuff for $10 Tuesday. Um for you guys. So it's I'm just flying by the seat of my pants on this one. Hoping it's going to turn out. 
So when you're making a, a, a bow with a bodabra, and you're making it with one-sided ribbon, now I always use wired ribbon, I don't use unwired ribbon. Wired ribbon tends to hold its shape. Unwired ribbon will not. Put it in here. Okay, one more loop on each side. You are doing a great job. Well, thank you, Lise. Thanks, Lise. All right. There's my last one on that side. I'm going to twist it. And then just bring it around. going to bring this down. And clip it off. This is also three yards. This one's three yards and it would have been $5.99. It's a crazy amount of money for ribbon. What do you think? Do you think it's crazy? I think it's crazy. I don't know, man. But they've got you... They've got you on this because where else are you going to get the ribbon? Really? So I'm just going to take a Chanel stem and I'm just going to secure the middle of this. And you're not going to see this. Pretty color. Yeah, it is pretty. It's very blue. But <clears throat> it's the same color blue as in here and the, the bunny is pink. So I thought that's pretty Easter-ish. Okay. So just give it a twist, make sure this is even, pretty close. Alright, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to just wrap this around the top of this wreath form, because you're not going to see this, guys. Give it a twist, right? So I've secured it to the top. And I'm going to clip this excess off. And I just tuck these down. Hey Stace, pretty color, yep. Alright, and then I'm going to fluff my bow. So, it's going to go down, middle, and up down, middle, and up on both sides. That down. Once again, you're gonna not gonna see it. And up, okay? And I will fluff these out a little bit more once it's all in place. There we are. Okay, so there's where we're at so far with the ribbon on the on the wreath form. Now I'm going to ducktail my ends. That just makes a nice V at the bottom. This keeps it looking pretty and I might tack those down. We'll see how it goes. Because you know I am winging it. Okay. So there's where we're at so far. Okay, now I'm going to put another Chanel stem as a hanger. Because you got to have it hanging from something. So I'm just going to give it a twist. It's not going to be very big. Hanger. I'm just going to fix this to the back. And I think I'm going to hot glue it. Because I don't want it to show. So I'm just going to click this excess off. And I'm just going to hot glue it in place. With a generous amount of hot glue. Just 
fits right inside that chenille stem and I'm just going to hold it in place for a second. Alright, i got to hold it for a second. Okay, we're at, there's where we're at so far. Now, while I'm holding this, we'll have a discussion about Sunday. Uh, so I was looking at all my stuff. Um, so are you guys okay for starting at 9 o'clock in the morning on Sunday? Uh, because basically I'm going to go through all my last year's wreaths at first. They will all be first. And then, um, and they're going to be less than half price, I think. And then uh, the new wreaths that I've made will be after those. Okay, so yeah, probably it'll take about an hour because there's quite a few things. Anyway, so the new wreaths will be a slight discount, uh, but not that much. I mean, they're not, I don't charge over amount for them anyway, so so should be good. I might take a little piece of ribbon, just a little piece to cover that. So I just got a little piece of an end and I'm just going to cover that with this piece of ribbon just so you can't see it, right? Alright. Just place it over top. And that just hides all that and it's a little bit of extra security for your hanger. Okay. Perfect. All right. Super. <laughs> so uh, the wreaths will include tax. Um, if I have to ship them to someone, um, shipping will be extra. But I've got a line on a guy that will ship anywhere in Canada for $11. So I'm going to talk to him this week. Because otherwise, Canada Post is just insane. Alright, so there's where we're at so far. Now, so right now we've got $1.25 in the wreath form. We have $5 in ribbon. And then I have this really cute half a bunny. He's got ears, ribbon, and I'm just going to take it off here. pretty cute and he's got like a hanger thingy but I'm not going to use that so I'm just going to take it out he's pretty cute fluff out the ribbon yeah he's pretty he's pretty cute and this is called a basket accessory and you can get this at Dollarama two bucks Need a wreath for work for the draw. Okay, you coming to London? So I am going to stick him right in the middle of my bow. And he's going to be terrible cute. Alright. So there's a little spot on the back I can affix some hot glue to. Use a generous amount. You don't want this bad boy coming off. All right, and just turn it and place it down in the middle of that bow and hold it in place. Oh, it's cute. This is, this is really adorable and this would look so cute in a bathroom or a small space or a small door. Oh, I think it's cute. I think we'll hang the ribbon down. So it looks good. Okay, still holding tight here. But look how cute that thing is. Can you guys see it? It's pretty cute. I'll hold it up really tight. Just need to hold it a second longer. Gorilla glue because it's the best. Yes, it is, Denise. Got that ingrained into your mind. Gorilla glue, gorilla glue, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, I use it because it works, right? The last thing I want to do is make something for somebody and 
have something fall off of it because I used dollar star glue. That like that's just wrong. So Gorilla Glue is my my end all. Okay, so I think it's done. So I'm gonna hold it up to you guys so you can see. It. Okay, he's that's this is cute. Here you go. What do you think? Little girl's nursery wall? Absolutely, Nance. What do you think, guys? So, $7. Add the tax. Go $7.50. You got yourself a cute little wreath. And I like it. You can play with it and everything. Right. Okay, so yeah, I am going to give this away to one of you guys that came on and said hi. And I'm going to put all your names in a draw, and I'm going to pull one, and one of you guys is going to win it. And I hope you hang it up and send a picture of it to me. Okay? So I'll do that when we're done. I'll do that tonight. And um, might do that as soon as I'm done. I'm just going to write all your names down, and I'm going to make a draw. All right? Uh, so that's it for today, guys. $10 Tuesday, spent $7.50, awesome, and um, I'll see you on Sunday where we're going to have a online sale on a whole bunch of wreaths, okay, so make sure you tune in right at 9 o'clock so you can get the good choices of stuff, good, love it stuff, thank you, thank you very much, it's adorable, yes, it totally is adorable, anyways, until Sunday guys, stay safe. Wear your mask, wash your hands, and uh, love you all. See you soon. Bye.